Hi, I'm Gwendolyn with iFixit, and this is Basic Skills, where I show you the tips and techniques of the skills involved with repair. Today, we're gonna talk about thermal paste, how to clean it and how to apply it. When disassembling a device, you're likely to run into an important, albeit frustrating and messy layer of thermal paste. Thermal paste is a thermally conductive adhesive that sits between a device's heatsink and a heat source like a computer's processor that improves cooling performance, preventing your chips from overheating. Whenever you discover old thermal paste during a repair, you're going to need to reapply a new layer before reassembly. If you're unsure about working with thermal paste, you're in luck, because today I'm gonna show you the basic skills involved with cleaning and applying thermal paste. For the cleaning of the heatsink and the processors, you're going to need a nylon spudger, a cleaning solution like Arctic Clean Thermal Material Remover, and a lint-free cloth or a coffee filter. Start by carefully scraping the paste with the flat end of your spudger. Get as much of the solidified paste off as you can, but don't worry about the thin layer of residue. We'll tackle that in the next step. To thoroughly clean off your thermal paste residue, place a drop of Arctic Clean Thermal Material Remover on the chip. Let it sit for a moment, then gently rub the paste away until your chip is clean, shiny, and ready for a brand new layer of thermal paste. It's important to remember not to touch either the chips or the heat sink with your bare hands or allow any dust or debris to get on them. Even a fingerprint can be a major obstacle to thermal transfer on a chip. Now it's time to add a new layer of thermal paste. Be sure that the heat sink and the chips are completely dry before you start this step. And for this step, you're going to need some plastic to protect your finger, either a sandwich bag or a saran wrap will do, and some thermal paste. I'm using Arctic Silver Thermal Paste, which you can find on our site. Wrap the tip of your index finger with your plastic and then dispense a very small amount of thermal paste onto the processor's core. Now you can use your finger to gently smear the thermal paste over the entire processor's core. There's no need to add paste to the heatsink too. The paste on the core should be enough for a great seal. Finally, apply your clean heatsink. Now you have the basic skills for cleaning and applying thermal paste. Have fun stepping up your repair game and let me know how it goes. You can find me on Twitter at Gwendolyn Gay and follow iFixit at iFixit. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and give us a like on Facebook at facebook.com slash iFixit.